Hi, I'm Jeff Rosenstock. I'm at Amoeba Records in Hollywood, and this is What's in My Bag. The first thing I'm pulling up here is Deltron 3030. Yo, it's 3030. I want y'all to meet Deltron Zero Hero. Not no small feet. Classic record. Everybody knows this one. Also, Del the Funky Homo Sapien. Great rapper. Occasional uh, guest star on the cartoon Craig of the Creek. So I remember hearing this record when I was in college and just being, I, I like wrote like fucking term papers on this. Like probably several because I didn't like reading. Who fuses the music with no illusions producing the blueprints? Clueless automator, the fight of laws of nature, electronic monolith, throw a jam upon the disc. I like reading now. I didn't really like reading that much then, but like I would read like a chapter or two and the thing I was supposed to read and find like a couple sentences and it'd be like, okay, how does this like have to, how can I like weasel my way into making this about like this record that I'm listening to obsessively? Uh, and this was definitely, there's a lot of, a lot of good stuff in here, especially if you're like a media studies major or whatever. It's just like, the future is crazy. <laughs> but yeah, I definitely wrote stuff about this. Definitely quoted like virus and stuff in papers. I wanna devise a virus to bring dire straits to your environment. Crush your corporations with a mild touch. Trash the whole computer system and revert you to papyrus. And then a bonus one from the rap section. This uh, full length LP from from the Boogie Boys. First of all, look at this Survival of the Freshest shirt. That is awesome. Uh, there's a song on here called Starvin' Marvin. I like that. Uh, and the first song is called Dealing With Life. I like that. I have a 12 inch, I think from the Boogie Boys, Zodiac, where it's just like a, a single of them rapping every Zodiac sign and like, what's up with it and stuff like that. Come on, feel the lemon heads, classic album. My CD book got stolen from my car recently, which is like, they broke into my car and took my CD book. That's it. Just leave the CD book. Like, you don't, you're, what are you gonna do with that? So I'm trying to like use the CD, build it back up, and it's proving somewhat difficult, but uh, it's nice. Lemonheads, that'll go good in the car. This record kicks ass. I don't have it. This is Gregory Isaacs. But whenever there is a storm, I know they've got to be a calm. Back in the, you know, five years ago day, like I, I always felt like the reggae section at any record store was like a good like pounce on it, find it for like five bucks, find it for like six bucks thing. It's not really that way. People have caught on that there's a lot of good shit. I feel like I found out about Gregory Isaacs from just like diving into reggae and dub for a while. And uh, now I don't have this record and I really like this record. Uh, check it out if you like that stuff. The song Storybook Children, it's fucking, it's a good song. It's a great song. Gregory Isaacs rules. Why can't we be like storybook children? And then I Love Built to Spill and they put out a new record and this record's pretty good. I have like keep it like a secret and perfect. All the all I have all the ones I really like, uh, and this is the first one in a while that I really liked. Just a dream, just cause I'm sweet. Reggae stuff again. Rebirth by Jimmy Cliff. This 
there's like a later era Jimmy Cliff record that uh, I you probably know about if you're a fan, but if you're not, you should fucking check it out. It's fun. He's like, you know, he's an old guy, obviously, but like his voice sounds really, really raw and really like, just like, he's just like shredding. Like, I don't think he's put out another record since. I've like, maybe just destroyed his voice making this one. It just, it's awesome. This record kicks ass. Oh, XTC Skylarking. I like XTC a lot. Started building up my little XTC record collection in when they all used to cost like three bucks or four bucks in record stores. And so now if I see some use, and I like this record a lot. I actually, I think I know it from the CD I bought over there for like a couple of bucks that was in my car. That's XTC, which was, this is Skylarking. Drowning here in summer's cold run Under mats of flower lava First time ever on vinyl, this Boris record, uh, Heavy Rocks. Of the Heavy Rocks collection that I guess they put out a record called Heavy Rocks every 10 years and I had never seen this on vinyl. And I like Boris a lot. Uh, they're loud and fast. Uh, you could kind of see the cover there. It's, it's a good UV varnish. Oh, this record rules. Uh, Denzel Curry, great record. Walking with my back to the sun. Keep my head to the sky. Me against the world is me, myself, and I like daylight. I like this record a lot. I really like the reissue or re, re the deluxe version that he did where it like played it all with a live band. Take away stress, we got your copy. But with all out is all forgotten. Keep on walking, me no stopping. And then dirty, dirty, rotten. That's a little what we call a home. Take it, blink it, swap it. That shit rules. This record's cool. Denzel Curry is great. I like him a lot. And I don't think I want an X Wing. I'm just on to the next thing. Since it's been put on all the stuff, uh, I've been listening to Balloon Mind State a lot. I'm shaking hands with many devils in the industry. Believe the genesis life it was tells me that I'm definitely like the autograph and sign until the break. There's a crazy, uh, although, yeah, I wonder if it's on here. Is it on here? Long Island Wyland? Uh, anyway, there's a Long Island shout out in this. Long Island is wallet. Long Island is wallet. And that's where I'm staying right now. Long Island is wallet. Uh, anyway, that was what was in my bag. That's that's what thank I Thank you so much. Thanks. Thank you so much for having me. This is really, really fun. We're stoked you came in today. I'm stoked to be here. It's cool. Speak. Even if it feels weird. 